here so it can connect the, the bolts you can see the bolts over here there is another connection on this side too one more connection here and another one over there okay I replaced the original connections the trailer with bolts this part I flipped it it was upside down so I flipped it this way no connection here this is more interesting connection so this one used to be flip it this way uh, so what I did you can see I cut part of this and I have two spacers to be able to adjust and straight um, the adapter underneath I can use so this is the original part I can definitely use a thick spacer but I decided to go with washers okay uh, this is interesting I purchased this one about a week ago the post and it came yesterday so I have installed this one here okay this uh, uh, Harbor Freight winch trailer winch the only thing that I have to do to be able to attach the winch was to drill a, a hole a new hole I used the existing one over here this new hole this is the bracket for the spare tire I'm not sure do you want to keep the, the bracket here or somewhere um, I can have it here or probably underneath the boat but I'm not sure maybe uh, I think I'm going to move the bracket somewhere here because I'm afraid when I have the tire it's going to be too low it may hit the tire the spare tire somewhere this is the trailer jack it's also coming from Harbor Freight okay so I have also two spacers to fill the difference okay, you can see them it was a little tricky to install this part because uh, it was over bended it wasn't straight it was like this so I have to open it to be able to uh, fit the spacers and everything else but uh, how I mentioned Because I didn't decide the size of the boat that I'm gonna buy, um, I'm still thinking between uh, 14 feet and 12 feet. I left the the extension a little bit longer. As soon as I buy the boat, pro, it looks like it's gonna be 12 feet. I'm gonna short the extension. I'm gonna cut one feet probably up to here and I'm gonna move the trailer jack and everything because I don't need to have so long trailer anyway um, there is another purpose that I can use this trailer of course I can always put the plywood back I can have uh, the, the frames on the side and everything so I can use it like a flatbed if I need it but there is something that I realize um, sometime I have to move uh, a long construction materials and 
I can probably have a little bracket here, like a T, like a not very light, uh, not very white T, and I can transport long 2x4s, whatever long construction materials I need to transport, and the bracket can be moved up and down for different sizes. Of course, I, I have to remove this post from here. So it looks like the trailer is gonna be a uh, multi-purpose trailer. It's not gonna be only for, for a boat because the boat is gonna be around 55 kilos, which is very easy to be removed, loaded and unloaded. 